complete with a pointing stick between the D and H keys and a function row that has quick controls for locking the PC, switching displays, disabling the touchpad, and adjusting brightness and volume. With an actuation required force of 55 grams, the notebook's snappy chiclet style keys allowed me to type at a brisk 81.6 words per minute with 94% accuracy on the Key Hero typing test. Although typing on the portage was pretty comfortable, the slight shallowness of the 1.25mm high keys made it a tiny bit difficult to differentiate between letters, and accounted for my few errors. The Portage's 4x2 inch touchpad has the same matte finish as the rest of the deck, and features two small ridges on the bottom that highlight the pad's left and right click zones. On default settings, the touchpad seemed to lag behind my finger slightly when I moved the mouse cursor though it was responsive for functions such as touch-clicking and pinching to zoom. The notebook's blue pointing stick was sensitive enough to allow me to accurately navigate the desktop with minimal pressure, with physical clip buttons below that were easy to reach with my thumb. The Portages included Wacom-powered stylus, which is similar in size to a standard pen and features two clip buttons, works seamlessly with its 10-point multi-touch display, making surfing the web and jotting down notes in tablet mode fairly hassle-free. A small cursor appears on the screen when the stylus is about a half inch away, making it easy to highlight specific browser tabs or individual keys on a virtual keyboard. The stylus really showed its strength when doing more tactile work, whether I was writing out website names in Internet Explorer or doodling in paint, the pen's responsive, retracting ballpoint, combined with the display's matte finish, made it feel like I was writing on paper. Holding the button on the side of the pen allowed me to perform right-click functions when tapping items, and automatically switched the pen to eraser mode when I was using paint. In the PC's pen and touch menu, you can customize the stylus sensitivity, as well as what type of mouse actions correspond with specific types of stylus taps. You can also toggle flicks, which allow you to easily scroll up and down web pages or go back and forward in your browsing history with quick swipes of the pen. You can further customize the pen in the Wacom Pen APP, where you have control over the firmness of the tip and eraser for art programs. If you happen to lose the Portage's main stylus, the distinct likelihood, as there's no way to attach it to either the tablet or the dock, the PC tucks a smaller emergency stylus onto the bottom edge of the tablet portion. The Mini Stylus doesn't have the control.